So once we're at our replet homepage, we're going to create our very first REPL. And what this does is it allows us to write code. So if I click up here in the top left corner, or you could click this right here, I'm going to go ahead and click Create REPL. And then I'm going to search. See, these are the favorites that pop up for me. But if I were to search HTML, comma, CSS, comma, JS, this one pops up. And that's the one we want, HTML, CSS, JavaScript. All right. And I'm going to name this. I'll just say example, and I'll put today's date. Today's date is the, let's see, I think today's the 4th. Right? I'm not sure. And I'll go ahead and click Create REPL. All right, so what happens here is it just loads all this code immediately. And you might look at this and be like, what the, in the world is going on? Don't worry. I'm just going to have you highlight all of that and delete it. And then you're going to go down here where it says script.js and click on those three dots and delete script.js. Are you sure you want to delete it? Yep. And then style.css. Click that and delete it. Are you sure you want to delete it? Yep. And this is where we're going to start with a blank page with nothing on it. All right. And we're going to talk about each element. But once you have actually created this first REPL, we can do things to it and we can start writing HTML.